Good morning. It is September 25th. On a Thursday morning, me and Zach are going teal hunting. Time check, 548. What is it, like 60 degrees? Little bit of north wind. Mm -hmm. Freaking uh -huh. little bit of little bit of little bit of clouds. Should uh -huh. have them absolutely moving around. We might actually finally be able to shoot a teal the third week of teal season. Yeah, yeah. That about sums it up. It's been pretty. Uh, but you know, don't have a bunch of people at the camp. Um, obviously it's on a Thursday we have another group that's going on another field they have some birds so hopefully everything gets pushed around with the weather and the, the little bit of groups that we have shooting out the other population over there and I don't know should be pretty good Boston here you go I think so. Dude, it sounds like it's warm. Yeah. Oh, oh, right here. Oh my god, dude, no way. You could barely see him. Try to let him light, I guess. I was trying to let him light, but. Oh, wait, 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 right here, right here, right here. I got that one. This, this one was like two yards in front of my barrel. Oh my God. I just cooked him. Bro. Oh, I got him. Oh my God, Hayes. Dude, I had to wait to shoot this one. I had to wait, I swear to God, two foot from my barrel. It flew directly to my face. They they were like, they were gonna come light right here if I didn't shoot. Nice. Nice, dude. Same. Dude, there's the three just like turn on the mojo, bro. On the mojo. But it sure sounded like, look right here on the right. On the right. Where? Where? Oh, God. I hit oh you with my, my gun. Wait. Wait. We each got one. I kn I think I killed mine on the water. Did you? Yeah, I, I shot one on my first shot. Me too. Dude, I sure thought I was on and good for the other shots. I got him. What a beautiful specimen. Wow. Yeah, a really nice one, eh? Like, pretty freaking good. 
Look at this cute little Johnson. Wow. Nah, them decoys good. Those just wanted it so bad that they didn't even swing. I mean, it was perfectly in line with the Yeah. Good thing. We would have. Well, they would have landed, I guess, but. Yeah, landing technique is hard. Get him, Corey! <laughs> Get him, Corey! He's going to Corey. He's dead. Mother Stay out. Nice double. Thanks, man. Thought I had the triple. Dude, I would have if that one fired. Throw that one, too. Yeah, dude, I just was right no, behind him. really have a shot. Uh-oh. Please come home. I got beans and bologna. Yeah. Morsel. Morsel acquired. A finisher. Mmm. Yo, I'm mad geeked right now. <laughs> Here you go, Hayes. I see them. We gonna let them light? Yeah, let them light. <laughs> Mother <laughs> dude. I got one. I don't fing understand, bro. Hayes did not. I got So you got limit. I got my limit, son. Uh I don't understand. Oh look, there's that one might come back. It's not patterning right, bro. We shooting it on the water and to find out and it it ain't it ain't doing how it's supposed to be doing. Really? Really? Yeah. There's such a high pressure load that they don't have unless you get a high pressure like a fucking Mueller choke tube that's missing that. Ah. Man, we need a we'd have to pattern his uh his dove shot and see. Cause that's bro, he surely was shooting the fing doves. Well yeah, it's a different show. Look at these jots. Look at this Johnson. Hello, Johnson. But he can lose my 12 gauge Well, he got a 12 gauge. Yeah, but it's held together with zip ties. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys. I done shot my limit. Time check is 8.08. .08. So, I got six. Hayes got two. I think we're going to give it till about 8.30 here. I'm gonna pick up this camera. New camera we're gonna be trying out. We've been having this forever, but we're gonna try this out. So hopefully I can get a couple flocks on film and see if Hayes can shoot a few. I've been sucking. Yeah, he, yeah, he's not good at shooting. Um, I'm not shooting my regular gun because I thought that I would be cool and 
use my over and under for the whole season. So, yeah, uh, I have not been hitting them, and I'm pretty upset. But I don't think it's your fault. We, we just patterned the gun like two or three times, and it was a different shot every time. So I think it's your gun. Quite possibly is or my gun. Shells. Could be a shells, but. I do have another 20 gauge. Automatic? A single blue wing teal, bro. Some bull. Oh my god. He'll come back. What? Yeah, but did you see where it shot? In the decoys, right there. Really? Yes. I killed him off the ricochet. Right here. I hate this thing. Cause I know I ain't that bad, bro. Yeah. Craziness. I guess we sit longer. Yeah, I'm never gonna lie. Alright. Dude, didn't he do it nice? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Alright fellas. Wrapping up the hunt. Ended with nine. Not terrible. Well, I was shooting terrible because my gun is a piece of <laughs> but we kind of got that sorted out. Um, you Definitely say would have had a limit. It was amazing that he was able to shoot three. Yeah. We patterned it even some more. and it, Or no, that last heel you shot. Dude, the last heel that I shot was on the other side of the decoys and it, it shot right where that green wing is in the front. Right here. And so. I killed it off the ricochet. So it was amazing that he even shot three. But our most productive and most enjoyable teal hunt of the year, which is pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, pretty terrible. This teal season has been absolutely trash. And on the weekends, there's been, we filmed all last weekend and there's been three groups in here, three groups in there. It's been an absolute cluster yeah so communism so it's yep we only saw 20 or less than 50 today. less than in between yeah. 30 and 50 I'd like say. this weekend we were seeing 100 200 birds but not shooting them because just the people out here but it was it was basically worse than public land yeah but you come out here on a freaking weekday and we had us a grand old time yes we did had some nice decoying. I hope y'all like all the different camera angles and stuff. And trying something new. Trying yeah. something new with that. So anyway, stay tuned. We're getting into something this weekend. I don't know what. And then Tuesday is opening of bow season, and we're actually going to shoot a buck. And squirrel hunting. It's going to be freaking epic. Stay tuned. It's all getting started. Just wait till the geese show up, son. Oh, All right. All right, folks, look at this. We got all these freaking wannabe duck hunters out here, freaking wannabes, but ain't nobody want to freaking pluck their ducks, singe them on the fire, clean them, and do it right. But you know we out here, and we doing it right. I mean, come on. Look at this. So let me see that. Oh, my God. It's perfect. Get out of here, bro. A technique learned and taught over many generations. Pluck them, leave the heads, leave the wings, leave the feet, keep everything dry, singe them, then gut them, cut everything off, clean them up, wash them up, vac seal them. I mean, come on. You're gonna spend all this money, 
You're gonna do all these things. You're gonna get out there early in the morning, and then, and then you're just gonna freaking breast these Johnsons. I mean, when God places teal on your strap with no pin feathers, it's a shame not to pluck them. I mean, you can't. It doesn't get no better than no. that. No. Yeah, let me. Let me see what this looks like. Oh my. Get out of here, bro. Cool! Woo! Look at that delicious morsel right there. Look at that one, dude. God. Finish gutting them, finish singeing them. That's how you do it. I mean, tremendous. And then uh, these hearts right here, it's gonna be part of my delicious breakfast. So, I think that'll wrap the video up there, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah, so we're probably gonna go hunt tomorrow, make a whole nother video out of that. But who knows, this may be the last duck video until duck season so stay tuned got a lot of good things coming up bucks squirrels bow hunting thanks for freaking watching <laughs>